moving around campus over the next few days, you can expect some delays as the Badger class of 2023 gets ready to move in starting and, Saturday. Yeah, and this year, new students have a practically new dorm to call home. I know Leah Linscheid is a little jealous of that. Christina Laurie is getting a tour of the newly renovated Witty Hall this morning. Hi, Christina. Hi, Josh and Leah. This is what $53 million in two and a half years of renovations will get you from an all new 11th floor to this wonderful lounge area all the way in the basement and everything in between. Brendan from University Housing is here. So what has been the biggest challenge in putting this all this work together? Yeah, I mean, it's a really complex project because we were trying to do this renovation top to bottom of a 55-year-old building to make it feel like a new building from, you know, top to bottom uh, while students were living here during the school year. So, but it really came together nice, added a lot of community space, makes it feel like a new building, uh, less than half the cost of what it would have cost to build a, uh, to build a similar new building. So uh, we're really proud of this project. And there are some energy efficient features to you're going green with this building? Yeah, so all new windows, uh, the room controls for, uh, for temperature, air conditioning, and that in all the, in all the resident rooms um, really makes it much more of efficient space and a lot of uh, really great spaces for the students to live in, too. And although thousands of families and students will be moving into this dorm, not everyone is going to be moving in this weekend, but they might still be impacted by moving. Yeah, so they'll be. We're moving in about 6,000 students over the course of Saturday and Sunday this weekend. So there will be some traffic, uh, some roads closed uh, right around this area in the um, Dayton Street, Francis Mills, Park Street kind of area. So um, most of that'll be reserved for move-in parking those days. But it's a well-oiled machine. You've done this for dozens of years, so. We're ready for it. Thank you so much for talking to us, Brendan. And if you are driving in or around the campus area on Saturday or Sunday, do expect some traffic delays. Josh and Leah. All right, bringing back memories of my day moving in, huh? A little different now, though. A little different, a little prettier. I would say. Christina Laurie, thank you very much. All right.